it's gorgeous. It's, I mean, it's just like this arete that just comes together at this sharp point, and it kind of, the rock is bright orange. It's white, and then it fades into this sharp, contrasting orange that, and then right on the arete, I'd say about this much of it is like really dark orange. And then as the rock goes up, the orange kind of like flames out just like, and that's kind of how the climbing goes. Like you start out kind of crimping your way up the arete and then the last little bouldery section, you just kind of like, you're starting tiny and then you're just kind of working your hands out with the, kind of with the flame. I got on it, I guess about two years ago and did pretty much all the moves except for one or two. I finally got back on it about, I'd say about a month ago for the first time and went up it and pretty much booted me. Like I, I was able to do all the moves for the first time, but uh, like it was, it was the first time I was able to do all the moves, but all the moves felt 10 times harder than I remember them being two years ago. There's another move after that that's off that crimp to a, uh, you kind of, you hit an intermediate, you hit the Vulcan pinch, you stop there, and then you hit an intermediate, and then you chuck to a, an okay sloper, but you kind of, you're coming across the rock, and your weight's going straight out, and you catch it, and your body just kind of like wants to sag that way, so it's kind of hard, and then the red point crux is, you have to clip there, and then, um, come back to the hold, you put your feet on a pretty bad foot and you start sucking in and going up and you grab a pretty bad crimp and then just like pull farther farther and then until your face is like right against the rock and then just kind of chuck to a pretty bad sloper.
after you do the that last red point crux, the the dyno to the sloper off the sloper. You get some good holds and you get a good rest, but it's not over. You still have like maybe 10 feet of climbing left. Get up there and it's fully dynamic and you're just kind of slapping your way up this barrette and your arms are getting further out. And so when you're in that situation, you're getting pumped. So I guess that's another red point crux. Probably rest for a really long time before I try and finish it off.